Living in a modern society comes with all the benefits and the stress associated with metropolitan lifestyle. Keeping and maintaining a balance is what many can't seem to find. In a city like Lagos, keeping fit and healthy seems far-fetched than a reality because of the hustle and the bustle in a concrete jungle. So how can one live healthy and get a level of fitness? We'll start by saying health and fitness are two different things, although they are closely related. Health is a state of total physical, mental, psychological, social, even spiritual well-being as far as Nigeria is concerned, and not just the absence of disease. You understand while fitness is just a state of being physically fit fitness is more of a physical thing it's brought about by physical activity and, con and nutrition you understand so you have to be fit to be healthy you cannot be healthy and not fit first they'd have to at least eat clean as best as they can um, eating clean would involve um, vegetables healthy carbs and protein, so basically balanced diet and of course exercising. Um, with a stressful city like Lagos, um, your best bet is the exercise, is the exercise you actually do and that's the easiest part which is just wake up in the morning and do something that you know you can consistently keep doing for the rest of the week. So for, the, for a busy city like Lagos, I advise you keep your exercises about five five minutes per day. That was the medical and fitness opinions on how one can keep fit and healthy in a cosmopolitan society. So what does a Nigerian on the street think on the benefits of keeping fit and healthy? When you eat healthy, you definitely would be healthy. If you don't keep fit, you suffer, you'll be suffering from malaria. You are healthy, you live long, health is well to say. So Keeping fit at, and it goes a long way to help someone live long. You'll be light. You're, I mean, you yourself, like uh, you say, you, 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 inside you know that you are light, you are free, you're not heavy, you're not feeling. Sometimes you feel like your body is stretched, uh, it's hard because all the fat, fat affects us a lot. So when you, when you keep fit, when you live, a, uh, you are keep, keeping fit and engaging in some fitness aside, it burns down all those calories, all those fat in your body. Maybe it helps the stress. The benefit, oh, number one, this is good to walk like every morning, like at least 20 meters or 10 meters, eh? Exercise. You understand? For you to keep yourself healthy, number one, you at least do exercise. You are healthy, you will be happy, and happiness is free. You're not as stressed as you know. And then on the body, yeah, I think it would tell on your body when you eat healthy and bad. I mean, if it, it helps you. It helps you. It, it helps your body system. It enables um, proper blood circulation. Like when you keep it, you, you, you sweat, and as such, you burn some calories in the body, which enables you to, to maintain fitness without um, having excess fat, and then helps you live long. Keeping fit and all that, it helps your, your blood to flow easily. I mean, and that's the, one of the fastest ways to, to know that you're healthy, because when your blood is flowing well and all that, you know that you are okay. You understand, like five meters or ten meters every morning is compulsory. And then every time, when you, you eat, at least try to walk around before seven thirty to eight. You keep your food balanced before you go to bed. So that this kind told me, oh, they see nowadays, oh, they see small picking, go see big belly, go see old man, see big belly, you know, go show. Do they exercise and are they conscious about their health and fitness? Sure, yeah. Because I've had, you know, some health um, scares in the past, so. Now I'm a bit more conscious. I'm conscious in terms of food I eat. Very, very. I only do exercises in the morning. That's my own. When I wake up in the morning, I'll do my exercise. After I do my exercise, I'll take water. I try to exercise. I like food. <laughs> like the morning. When I wake up in the morning, I come to do sit up. You know sit up? After sit up, I'll now go like 20 meters road walk. Before I take my bath, now I can take one cup of coffee or top, then go to work. Of course, everybody should, so I am. Take care of myself, I eat well, I will watch over my body, not to fall ill and all sorts of precautions. Like I said, Lagos lifestyle, sometimes you so choke with traffic or so choke with activities of the day that you might not even eat well. So sometimes you find out you end up eating gala on the road or eating one snack or something or one drink, but which I try to reduce as much as possible. Yeah, I don't just eat any half food like that. So I'm conscious of what I take in because what I take in can affect my system. But I try to exercise, yes. 
The word health refers to a state of complete emotional and physical well-being, while fitness is a state of health and well-being, and more specifically, the ability to perform sports, occupation, and daily activities. But in today's world, how can Nigerians improve upon their fitness and health? Not just eating right. There are some certain habits you need to imbibe when eating. For example, you do not skip breakfast. You stay away from caffeine. Keep ourselves hydrated. Another way to stay healthy, you sleep. Like I already mentioned before, minimum of seven hours in a day. You exercise. Exercise is very, very good. I'm not saying lift heavy weights, jogging, slow, prolonged jogging, not running fast. You try as much as possible to stay away from alcohol. And smoking, you stay away from smoking. The acceptable level for smoking tobacco, I don't mean any other thing else, I'm talking of tobacco. The acceptable level for smoking tobacco is zero. There's a general consensus that regular activities can improve physical fitness and health and assist in the prevention of diseases, as several studies have shown that active adults are healthier and have a higher balanced life through different nations and population groups. Like I said, exercise regularly. Um, your exercises should vary. Uh, it should vary in the sense that um, you should mix up your cardiovascular exercise, which are exercises that work your heart and lungs, and strength training exercises, which are exercises that work your muscles. So um, combining the two consistently is the most efficient way to get an exercise regime or to exercise generally. Health industry practitioners would advise you to be as lean as possible without being overweight. Be active more than 30 minutes every day. Avoid sugar, limit consumption of packed foods and alcoholic drinks. Balance one's diets with varieties of vegetables, grains and fruits. With these few steps, it's possible to channel yourself to a healthy, fit lifestyle. All right, you welcome back to the Balance Isle of Teletainment this morning. Now, with that one, you go see say for inside Las Gidi, I know for sure, and I can tell you for free, you can take it to the bank. Say for inside Lagos State, a lot of Lagosians now they try to live very healthy. A lot of Nigerians now they try to commot their mind from all those um, processed foods and they try to eat more of natural foods and a lot of natural fruits. I will not say this part of the world will they blessed with organic fruits. That would mean say fruits where the amount of fertilizer or chemicals that they use, you know, you know they're as large as some other developed countries. And that's now why for those developed countries, organic fruits are even more expensive than the regular one. But for this part of the world, and even though we still get them um, seasonal, and but the ones where even there for season, when they come out for season, the amount of chemical would we they you know they as um, as terrible as some other places. And now a lot of Nigerians are becoming very health conscious. A lot of Nigerians now but they try to live healthy lives, you know, try to eat well, try to rest well, even with the Lasgidi traffic, with the hustle and bustle, people are still trying their best to make sure say they live a very healthy lifestyle. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.